Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. I'm so excited to take you guys along with me throughout my days as an intern here at NASA JSC in Houston, Texas. I am part of the US VVO team or the United States Visiting Vehicles Operations team. Ultimately, what we do is work on vehicles approaching and undocking the ISS or the International Space Station. So my job as an intern is to build displays or tools that will help flight controllers on existing vehicles or on future developing vehicles. Most of my work, this internship has been with future developing vehicles. Before interning here, I was so curious what working at NASA would be like. So I'm super excited to take you guys along with me. Hopefully you guys can get a taste of what it's like, meet my teammates, and see a little bit of the NASA campus. We have a group meeting today. It's kind of like a weekly update meeting within my team. I believe I have a tag up with my mentor. I'll be working on closing up and testing some projects that I finished up last week, doing some tests to wrap up my internship. Oh, today's the all hands social, and then we might be going to trivia today, although that is TBD, depending on everyone's schedule and how the day goes. That's all I have scheduled for today, but every day is always full of surprises. So let's get going. So far from me now. If I turn it up, can you hear the Good sound? Morning. Thank you. Just give me a shout. I'm stuck, holding on, trying to let go. Is another song. Feels like if I did, I would do it wrong. I guess we are, we are. I'm in the office. <laughs> they have free Diet Cokes in the fridge. Hold on, I'm gonna flip the camera. I can hear you calling. I hear you often You said always if I stay in your head Every day always on my brain Think of you Everything always fades away And if we do the same always Remember days like the day when we say Always Always You said always Yeah, concur A firm. All right, this is Noah. All right. So Noah's training. What are you training for? And what does your training look like? So right now I'm doing my uh, generic training and I'm also training for CST 100. Um, on both vehicles, I'm training to be a visiting vehicle profile. Um, so right now that looks like a lot of sims, studying the systems, and also helping out with uh, ops products generation when needed for CST. What's your favorite part about the job? probably all the technical stuff I get to learn. Lots of, pretty much always learning. And always something new to learn and lots of really cool people to learn it from. My name's Christian and currently I am studying visiting vehicle support. It's a back room role, so you see the people in the front of Mission Control. Usually they're talking to many other people in other rooms in Mission Control. Um, they have in their headsets, just giving them information. We train on a vehicle called HTV by JAXA, the Japanese Space Agency. We train a lot by doing simulations. The simulation is basically where you sit down at this desk with a lot of data coming at you. It's all the data that you would see in real life. Then things start breaking. We have to figure out how we're going to fix this problem. How does this affect rendezvous and capture and everything? It's Jose! <laughs> this is Jose, my mentor. And we needed someone to explain what Arrow is. <sighs> yeah, so. <Good> luck. <laughs> no. Can you explain to yeah, us? Yeah, there's a bunch of people in this hall. Yeah, yeah there is. But you know what? There's only one person named Jose who could explain Ever? what Arrow is. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people named Jose. Okay, Jose is the best at jokes. 
The Aero's job is to be the liaison between NASA and the visiting vehicle provider. We basically have our own inside person who can make sure that they're able to get all the information the provider needs from NASA and we're able to get all the information we need from the provider. Falling to pieces in my room Are you coming over? That's cool I could use a little something to do We could go outside, take a little ride if you want to That's cool I did what I was supposed to There's nothing left for me to do So now I'm poking out my head through open windows Cause that's what I feel like The support console. Mm -hmm. This is the profile console. Okay. Start out with all the, uh, this is Shrock. DoD consoles that sometimes we use. Okay. That's it. A recycling thing right there. Nice. There's a burn box around the corner. Okay. So put your cord table in there. Okay. Yeah. We have chairs. This is the Mox. Okay. <laughs> All right, back to work. I'm starting to think that I do things way too differently. Trivia, and we're waiting for our team to get here. And I'm here with Christian. Kyle is right there, right on time. And finally, Jose. Oh, yes, that's it, that's it. That's it. That's it. Guys, we got six for six on the first round. On the second round, I hope we can get two. I don't even know. Uh, uh, we this thing. But this one's terrible. Terrible. Did we we get them all. 100%. <laughs> We're taking home the championship. We're going to win it all, guys. Yeah. So intense. Yeah. 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 I'm proud. I'm proud that we came in third place. That's a bronze medal. I feel good. I feel good about it. I feel like it was deserved and well earned. Deserve isn't on camera, but he says that he's having the best time of his life. And yeah. And I'm the best intern ever. That's what he said. Good morning, you guys. It's the next day. Cause baby, love.
currently headed back to campus. For the first part of the day, I'll be in a training room, so I won't be able to film much of that. But later on in the day, I'll be back in the office. And towards the end of the day, I'll be headed to a tour and you guys can come along with me. And I'm so excited for that. That's all I really have planned for today. Let's just see where the day takes us. that I worked on at this internship is CST 100 and that's what that class was pertaining it was like basically like a sim and you get to actually fly the spacecraft and actually get a feel for the console and how to deal with different failures malfunctions different conditions different abort types things of that nature so it's so awesome to actually apply all of the orbital mechanics and knowledge about sensors and just different failures and backup options and see what it's like from the point of view of an astronaut which will help the understanding of a flight controller the procedures and just understanding the vehicle in general so really cool Taking a brain break. This is Eric and this is Kyle. So most of my job is training, um, but I'm studying and learning things for our task list, which are things that we have to be subject matter experts in. And I also support the gateway program uh, with updating documents and requirements and trying to brainstorm new ideas for vehicle rendezvous. That's so cool. What's your favorite part about being in VBO? The opportunity to sit in front of the computers and feel like you're working a mission and look at telemetry coming down. Just the, like the control center type part of it is really cool. Nice. How about you, Kyle? What you said, nice. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite part would probably be uh, the team we got to I agree. I love our team. Oh, what is going on? Sun 
inside got me tripping right into your arms, your arms. Headed straight down through the night clouds, so is my heart pounds. Ten thousand feet, but you're my parachute, baby. No, you catch me whenever I fall. I know you got me. I'm sorry. 